Oh, there's a tree. Belly of the beast. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. What a rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Uh, uncertain. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm very Caitlin, uncertain. What do I do? Oh, wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <sighs> oh, no way, I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. The body in the lake, too. Remember what Jacob said? Yeah, right. Listen to me, these people are not who you think they are, I promise. I thought that was big, friendly giants. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature it's feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Is it silver? It's silver and it. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Quarren, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live when he's not at camp? I mean, uh, what makes oh, you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? I, uh, you spent the last two months here. He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude! What? Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, mm. when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? And don't forget about Nick, dude. God, listen okay, to an ounce, I'm going to spray you to with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. Oh, I'm going there with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. There's no way I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on your own. Wow, are you flirting with me? What? No. Fine, do whatever you want. Maybe he is. <laughs> you saw what happened to Nick? He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. I mean, again, another point, you know. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan, get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two, I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure, yeah. Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? 
This doesn't feel right. I think you're up to something. Something's going on. I'm not. You better not just be running out the clock. I'm not. The longer we're out here, the longer we're in danger. Said the murderer. You know, it might be a lot more pleasant if you lighten up a little. What is wrong with you? Um. I've had kind of a fucked up summer. Yeah, well, doesn't kill you makes you stronger. And what's that supposed to mean? I don't know. I, you're still alive, I guess. Nobody else needs to get hurt. An eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. No offense. I'm not doing this for revenge. I need to save Max. You're doing all of this for a boy? What am I supposed to do? Just leave him like this? I owe it to him. Like I said, kind of a fucked up summer. Is that where? There it is. Hack your house. Oh, where they live, is it? So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there, but. So I'll live there. for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. I got it. I get it. You know. I understand. Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura. Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Brian. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. Hey, where are you going? You're on a timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. Oh, God. Well, I think you found a way in. Holy shit! Are you okay? Laura? It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Great. Oh my god, Laura. Jesus, Mary and Jazz hands. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. Oh. What big eyes you have, Grandma. No shit. That heals you. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Define yellow. We haven't got much time. Okay, that's cool. Go, oh, Billy. Tools. Mine? Minecraft? These must have been from the quarry days. No, duh. No one's been down here for years. Again. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure that's his mother. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. Mom. Mama is a hang of Hackett's quarry. Think anyone heard that? No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Whoa! Just keep moving. Yeah. Careful. Jeez. You push him in and pull him back in again. Just look at this place. Oh, Good, bro? Long way down. <laughs> what is he doing? Caving. Good idea. Hmm. So, what's your deal then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? You know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, until now. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin, is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Yeah, she she has the hots for me. Dylan does too. Oh, modesty, thy name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's just a fact. They're not exactly secretive about it. So what about you? Who do you like more? I don't know. Maybe neither. Does he like her? This way. I see a light. Yeah. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. Someone's been eating their spinach. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? Oh, yeah, yeah, right. Okay. Wheel of Fortune. Hi. Looks promising. Looks active. You know? You know, you know? Careful. Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. Guess we found the party. Alcohol. From Prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. 
Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. That makes sense. I guess when the quarries are done, they branched out. Come on, time travel later. Ah, I could run this, eh? <laughs> you think this is it? Uh, beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Shall we? Oh, they're gonna go in. Spook. Ah, uh, okay. Back at Squarry Lodge. Oh, we're back here. My bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Kidnap. Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean, should we go find them? Okay. Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. Wait. What? Wait a minute. Oh, let me help again. Is there... Is there something in there? I don't know. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? Are they... Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. Raccoon? Ah! Oh, she makes me! She makes me! Oh. Hey, hey, it's us! Oh, oh shit. It burns. Oh my god. Oh. I, wait. I'm wait. so sorry. Dylan, I am so, so sorry. Oh, I didn't know it was you. I was really Dylan. scared and I thought it's not Mace. What? <laughs> oh my Airfresh. god. It's all I could find in the van. <laughs> uh, Dylan, <laughs> you're, uh... <laughs> so she was in the police station this whole time? Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. Jeez. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. Sounds like a long shot. Uh, encourage. Dylan, why come not? On. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. What exactly are we supposed to do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, there's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. All right. Abby, you're with me. Good luck.
Mm -hmm. I've got a feeling about this. What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh my god, oh, it's the insidious we woman. We got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. She knows. Keep it down. You keep it down. Shh. This way. Oh, it's Figgy. Oh, yeah. Is that gasoline? Careful. Okay. Don't do it. Don't do it. Hey. Bad idea. Oh, shit. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. He did, didn't he? Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. Boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. Uh oh. No. Not good. God damn. No. No, no. No, no. Not my granddaughter. Not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit! Not my little Kaylee! God damn you! What did you do to her? Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Wait! It's him! Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promised. Fine. Fine. you got to get me out of here. Okay, seriously, man. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. <laughs> God 
Damn it. Damn it. Not you fucking piece of shit! Get away! Get away from me! Okay, okay, okay. Talk me through it. Okay, so all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Right. Oh, cool, thanks, Detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, fuck you. I'm trying to Shut up. Shut up. Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay, hang tight. Okay. Um, five. So his cage was five. So, did we add him up? Yeah, fuck it. Dude, nice. All right, now don't fuck it up. What? I can do this. I can do this. Focus, dude. Focus. Um. That was a free one there. But we have to do two, don't we? So. Hey. Oh, damn. You look awful. Thanks. Hell. Where's everyone else? Um, Jake. Emma wasn't with them. I don't know where she is. But you should go catch up with them. Be careful. We came into the mines. I don't I don't know if there's a way back up. Not my, not God, not, not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. I'm afraid so. What? So you, you had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail for two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that instead of putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains? You, you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it? Is that what you are telling me now, Travis? Yarp. No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh my God, we are way past that now. Oh, Ma, what, what if it had been me or, or, or Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Well, I just don't, I, I don't understand why you, you, you couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer! Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker! <laughs> now I'm blind. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire! Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Would you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you... Piece of shit. Yes. Uh, 
Hello. Ryan, run! Ma, send Bobby down. Did you miss me? Hopefully, you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, strictures designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. <laughs> Details. Yeah, why not? Uh... Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Will of fortune. Oh. Go. You still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. 